Hi, it's Karen Jacobson, the GPS girl, and on Navigating New York, today we have Sonia Sartre. Hi, Hi, Sonia. And this is an interview on the run. This is how it is in Manhattan sometimes. <laughs> When did you come to New York? Uh, I came here twice. First, I came here about oh, too many years. I don't want to count because I uh, was cast as Lucy Cooper Spaulding on Guiding Light and we, soap opera star. Yes, yeah, so we got we shot here in New York, and I was here for a lot of years while I did that. Then I went back to LA. Then I came here to do One Life, and then to live another soap opera. Life to live another soap opera, and then I was Psycho Nurse Barbara, and then I went back to LA, and then I came back here again about nine. Why do you stay? What do you love about New York? Oh, this is the best city in the world. I love New York. It's so funny. For as crazy and neurotic as New York is, I actually feel calm. Calmer here than anywhere else. But I love the, the energy here. I love the people here. I love everything that you can do. I love that it's 24-7, 365 days a year. I just... I love everything about New York. I am 100% a New Yorker. So tell us, do you have um, like an it could only happen in New York kind of story? Oh gosh. Um, you know, I think I have two. One, um, I, I had just had my daughter, and so she was in one of those carriers. And it was, I was caught in the rain, and suddenly it was just pouring. And so, and she was little, she was only like two months, so you know, and it was my first child, so you're that overprotective mom. <laughs> So I'm huddling underneath some roof and um, this woman comes up to me and she just hands me her umbrella. She's just like, here, looks like you need it more than I do. Like a random umbrella gift? A random umbrella person. Oh. I was just like, that is awesome. And I did think, you know what? Only in New York. <laughs> do you have some savvy New Yorker tips? Now, some people will be coming here to visit, others will be living here, but what's something that you can, you can tell us about New York, you know, some insider knowledge? Uh, do something in every part of New York City. New Yorkers, interestingly, get locked into their little things. When I lived in the West Village, it was the joke that nobody would ever walk beyond 14th Street. Like, oh, I don't go above 14th Street. Yeah, no. I, well, the very hip, cool people do not go That's above true, 14th they don't. Street. I'm not in that category, by the way. <laughs> no. And now that I'm on the Upper West Side, I don't go down to the West Village all that often, even though I love it down there. So I, I think it's it's almost an exercise of you got to choose something in every little pocket or every little... Uh, every area of New York so that you really get to have the full experience. It's just fun and it's interesting and it just makes you appreciate how unique and wonderful a city really is. I like to call it the United States of New York City <laughs> because it really, <laughs> it really is, is so incredible. It is. Uh, Sonia, can you give us a little name dropping? Because you're, you're such a big, you know, you are such a big soap opera star and you just really you know, you've just had an incredible ride as an actor and now as a professional speaker and empowerment uh, adventurer and, you know, you come into contact with some amazing people, so. Oh gosh. Um, well, all right, I will have a name drop. In my, in my uh, acting days, I, I had a meeting with Robert De Niro, <gasps> which was the pretty Robert cool. De Niro. That was pretty awesome to sit next to him in his, his uh, office. Giant office. Wow. Yeah. Thank you. Fun. Thank you for the little bit of name dropping. <laughs> well, Sonia Sartre, thank you so much for joining us on Navigating New York. <laughs> I'm Karen Jacobson, the GPS girl, and you have reached your destination. With the stars. This episode of Navigating New York is brought to you by Essence of Valley, natural products for health, beauty and well-being. Visit essenceofvalley.com.